The Road Famous Comedy Store for a brand new episode of Kill Tony Volume 2. Give it up for Tony and Square. Yeah! Hi, everybody. Wow, what an exciting show. Look at these two people, not even clapping. Who gives a fuck? Just look at me right in my fucking eyes with your hands on your hips. I like that. Thank you. It makes me feel really good about this show. Fuck yeah. Everybody else seems pretty alive. How are you, Monday night? It's, it's tough to get a party started on a Monday at 8 p.m., but we managed to do it. We, we ease into it. We're easing into it. Hi, Brian. Hi. How's we, it going? We had a lot of fun. We were in Sacramento and San, San Francisco. Francisco. Had a great time. Mm -hmm. Tony danced. Mm -hmm. I caught... I, it wasn't a dance. <laughs> there was rumors of me dancing. He tried to convince me that I was dancing, and I said, what? And he showed me video of somebody that looked like me dancing, and I started freaking out. <laughs> he was like, Brian, you must... we we got to talk about this tape. You need to destroy this tape. Like, you were really concerned about this tape getting out of you dancing. Well, we were laughing about it. You're forgetting to mention that part, but yeah. yes. Uh, yes, I was laughing and telling you that you had to delete the tape. <laughs> talk about our artist. <laughs> yeah, we have a great artist here today. Uh, he comes uh, every week. Uh, what's your Twitter? Ryan J. Ebelt. Ryan J. Ebelt. Uh, e check. E he, tr he drew us uh, last week, which was really good, and we forgot to talk about it. But you can go on his Instagram and check out all his drawings. Ebelt? What yeah. is it? Ebelt. Okay. E -B -E -E Put your hands together for our artist. Drawing the show tonight, yeah. everybody. Yeah. Nice. Keep your hands going for our one and only sponsor, the best chef in the world. It's Chef Elise Lane. She's sitting right over there, everybody. Tonight she made cumin spice quinoa with Tuscan kale, chickpeas, and feta. And our choice of salmon or steak. I went with the salmon, and Brian went with the delicious steak. Look at that. Mm. Yum, yum, yum. Follow Chef Elise Lane on everything. Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Everything is Chef Elise Lane. It's no longer the girl with the pan. So you're already following her if you follow the girl with the pan. But let's never mention the girl with the pan again. It's Chef Elise Lane. That's E-L-Y-S-E-L-A-I-N, everybody. Guys! your hands together for Pat Reagan and the baby boys. They're here tonight. Yes. Pat, the, my vision is slowly coming true of this entire thing. You, I've always called you the band leader, but it's always just been you. And finally, after about four or five weeks of me calling you a band leader, you finally brought somebody else with you. Well, I've been doing such a dog shit job the past couple weeks that I wanted to save myself and bring along another person to sort of pass off the blame to. I love that. Ian Edwards ruined you two weeks ago. Basically took all of your confidence or just straight up away from you. So if you're wondering why Pat is uh, so, so, so struggling right now, go back two episodes and listen to two Mondays ago with Ian Edwards. Anyway. Josh is too Pat. busy uh, periscoping to actually yeah, Josh do his now job periscopes. Now. He was already the world's worst producer, spilling drinks and just pouring things on people, never being in the right position at the right time. And now he's periscoping the shows, uh, even, like, even though we're live on Ustream, which, you know, boy, we, we were really late to that party, huh? Yeah. We finally got on Ustream, and then three weeks later, this fucking periscope thing comes out. I know. Jesus Whatever Christ. Ustream doesn't ban your accounts, wow. usually. I got my... Uh, Periscope banned last night. What? Yeah. What happened? Don't know. Actually, I just found out what happened. Uh, there's one bad flaw about Periscope is if you really hate somebody, you could just flag their broadcasts a few times, and it will just ban your account. Man, the comedy is really flowing in this room so far. Uh, it's a hot Monday night here at the Comedy Store. Can everyone please flag Josh's uh, account? Oh, no. Don't, so. don't say that or else the poor, he's a, you know, <laughs> poor kid already has nothing going on in his life. The last thing he needs is the one thing that he's staring at right now to disappear. Josh Martin, everybody. He's on Twitter at Josh Martin Comic, the butt of our jokes, the man that makes it all happen. Actually, follow his Periscope because they're great. He's one, I don't watch many, but watching Josh live his life every day is one of the most adorable things ever. Yeah, he's one of only six people I follow on Periscope. Yeah. That's an that's a elite class, Josh. Well, Pat, you excited? Yeah. Me too. Let's do it, guys. Every week, uh, over 30 comedians sign up for the chance to do a minute, and they perform a minute, and me and two of the funniest people in town talk to them after they perform that minute. Ladies and gentlemen, two of my favorite guests ever. Put your hands together for Godfrey and Rick Ingram, everybody. Here they are. Here they are. King Kuka. There we go. Fuck yeah. Cut that music anytime, Brian. Fuck yeah. Rick Ingram and Godfrey, guys. Tell them Welcome. What up, fuckers. How you doing? 
<laughs> Welcome, Godfrey. This is your first time on the show. Yeah, man. Welcome to the craziness that's How about the to fuck ensue. Is fucking, what is this? It's craziness. It you're, is. You're gonna man. love it. Okay. Godfrey's from New York, so this is his first time uh, mm. being on Kill Tony. On this Kill Tony, yeah. Yes. Is that what it's called? Uh huh. Okay. Sure. Now Rick here next to you was actually on episode one. Fuck. Yeah. I was here for the beginning. I said. <laughs> We're on a train to kill a million dreams. And yes. We're halfway there. Nice. Yes. We like are, the Amtrak. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we are at 500,000 dreams crushed on this show. Uh, we're going for McDonald's numbers, though. <laughs> Billions yeah. served. Every week, I always have Pat Reagan ask my guests a question. I guess something, something he might want to know as a mm. young, rising stand-up comic. Mm. I guess I'll start off with Rick. Rick, uh, mm. you say you want to crush dreams. What is the hole in your heart that makes that a thing that you want to do? Um, well, I'm not sure what you just asked me, but <laughs> what, I, what I'd like to say is, to me... With that Everly Brothers microphone. <laughs> uh, <laughs> musical comedy is a lot like what went on at Penn State. <laughs> Even if you're really good at it, I don't support it. You know what I mean? <laughs> but, you know, keep up the good work. Keep up the good work. That was funny as shit. Uh, hell yeah. Uh, Pat, what's your question for Godfrey? Oh, fuck. Oh, uh, Godfrey. What's up, dude? Uh, what's, uh, you're in a relationship, right? I, yeah, fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hey, hope, I, I think I still am. Fuck. Go yeah. ahead. Did you fuck up? I'm, oh, of course. Is that your question? Of course sure. I fucked up. <laughs> okay, well, what, what do you want me to what do you, what's, what what's How's question? it going? <laughs> I mean, there it is. Oh, fuck. This guy's oh, like it's all right. I mean, I'm, I'm a comic. I'm fucking selfish. You know, I'm a narcissist, man. You know, um... I got to learn to be selfless, I guess. <laughs> it's all right. I, when I get back to New York, I'll see what's going on. Damn. <laughs> what, 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 <laughs> what I'm taking it day by day, you know what I mean? Real. I, gotta I get the one answer text now. She used to send me paragraphs. <laughs> Shit's no more. When, they, Shit. when women stop sending you fucking paragraphs, they don't give a fuck anymore. <laughs> I'm not bullshitting you. Women usually give you paragraphs. Did you read the first part? Did you read the second part? <laughs> fuck. <laughs> you know, there's more. Now she's like, nope. Okay, bye. <laughs> Shit. My power is gone. Fuck, yeah. <laughs> Great question, Pat. That you asked me that question. Fuck. Pat, you're na you nailed it on the questions tonight. This might be your uh, redemption. It's that magic mic, man. <laughs> Fuck. I love it. So, uh, guys, you know the deal. Over 30 comedians signed up for the chance to do a minute of stage time and then talk to us immediately afterwards about anything in the world. Um, guys, you know your 60 seconds is up when you hear the sound of a kitty. That's adorable. You better wrap it up then, or else you're going to bring out the angry West Hollywood bear. Damn. Wow, there it is. You don't want to bring that up. Yeah, like it is that. bumping tonight. Brand new speaker system. I hope you get a real bear. Yeah, we're Fucking working awesome. on it. We're working on it. Big live it's show. A mall of fucker who bombs. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to talk. I mean, that would be motivation to really bring your A game. You know? <laughs> I love it. Let's get it started, guys. Your oh. first comedian doing one minute uninterrupted oh, tonight wow. goes by the name of Josh Fry. Yes. That's a good name. That's a good comedy name. All right. Thank you. Thanks. Yes. I'm so excited for everybody here tonight. And uh, party for you guys tonight. Party for you guys. Yeah. At my house tonight. Let's go, or in the gray in the alley behind the Greyhound bus station where I'm staying. We'll party till they kick us out, guys. Till the Greyhounds come. Woof woof. Oh, get out of here. All right. Thanks. Um, there's another something. Man, the bus must take forever here, man. I've been here 12 days. The bus must take forever. Everybody's falling asleep waiting for the bus. Can't find a seat waiting for the bus. Everyone's taking a nap. By the Something else here. Oh, yeah. Everyone says I sound like Mitch Hedberg. Yeah, his spirit lives inside me. Oh, yeah. 2005, March 30th. I was craving some heroin. I didn't know why. Uh, I was 15 years old. I found some. Fuck yeah. Nailed it. 
Oh, wow. I liked his energy, damn it. I liked his fucking energy. That was good Very for you. Give, give a round of applause for his energy. I liked your energy. You didn't, I, we didn't know what the fuck you were talking about. But God damn it, your energy. And it was like some Mitch, shitty ass Mitch Hedberg. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Bless his soul. He's a friend, good friend of mine. But it was some shitty Mitch Hedberg. But I liked your fucking energy. You, that was all right. Because you know what? When we started, we were just as shitty. Well, but I got better well, laughs, so I ain't gonna yeah, lie. I, I got know. better <laughs> But I liked your energy. I liked the fucking, oh, 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 and it was, what the fuck was that? But yeah. you, you committed to that bullshit. <laughs> and that's what I like. When you commit True. to bullshit, you just keep doing it. One day you're going to have real shit. Yeah. As long as you commit. You know what I mean? That's why we were laughing. We were like, what the fuck was that? But yeah. you got to laugh, though. How's that? There you go. That's my critique. Fuck yeah. Thank you. Um, <laughs> I love it. it was, that was, we, we, we see who good cop's going to be tonight. Yeah, I was going to uh, say. <laughs> I don't know how you were able to be quite so positive, but I'm impressed. <laughs> it was like, like positive, horrific yeah, at the yeah. same time. Um, yeah, I mean. Yeah, rip, rip right into me here. I, I like that you look uh, like you just got back from Vietnam. <laughs> I think that's that's a brave decision. <laughs> Hard to pull off in 2015. Yeah, it takes very specific thrift store moves. To, I, mean, uh, he, I believe he up. was an extra Damn. from Forrest Gump, if I remember correctly. Awesome. Um, yes. Yeah. I, I mean, <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, I like that he's crazy. He's like, yeah. <laughs> I like this dude. Fuck yeah. Josh well, Fry, good comedy name. Fuck that. That is a good Josh comedy. Fry is the shit. Yep. Sure. There was Glenn Fry. Fuck that dude. Josh Fry, the heat a is lot, on. A lot of people don't go as far <laughs> as to say fuck Glenn Fry, but I think it's about time. I do. After he left the Eagles. Fuck that dude. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead. He took off his jacket, too, to get yeah, some more. Yeah, <laughs> which is really interesting to reveal another terrible layer. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> What is, what is that shirt? Well, nice! Going? Look at this oh. dude. I love this Is dude. that the Vietnamese? Wow. He's keeping it fresh. Man, he, he is not playing this dude. Are you, are you really That's homeless? Amazing. Somehow he went from American Vietnamese soldier to Vietnamese Vietnamese soldier yeah. in no time. Uh, how, that, lo how, how long, long have you crime? been homeless for? Just 12 days. Just 12 days. Where so. did you come from? Upstate New York. All yeah, New baby! York. Represent... <laughs> oh, wow. I didn't like that, that part. That was a yeah. true camera was a point. Very, I was just actually representing. They could see it if they want. This is pretty crazy. How long have you had a, a, uh, a case for your uh, pager? What is that? What do, you, what, do you, what, do you, what do you keep in that magical case that's on the side there? I like that fit. <laughs> that dude is a player, boy. Wow. He got business, motherfucker. I was just cashiering at my job, and uh, an old lady, very nice old lady, gave this wallet to me. And uh, because she was just so nice, I didn't want to take it. But then I gave her a hug, and uh, and then I realized this shit goes on your belt. Right. Yeah, dude. None of that, that happened. That story. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'll tell you. You're a, a James Fry. What's your name? Jim, Josh. Josh, Josh Fry. Fry. I'll tell you what's fried. Your brain. Whoa, whoa, Pat. Wow. The hell is that? He's, being, he's being evil. Your of brain. I love, the, I love the mandolin coming in yeah. after that. Is that what's happening? When you make a joke, you got to Everly him Brothers hair. I love that. You got the rim shot. Everly bye, Brothers. bye, look. It is. I love, I love Pat's. Uh, Pat. Why is he taking off all his clothes? Oh whoa, 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 no. whoa. Oh, I'm fucking up right now, yo. That's what I'm doing. He's committed bad. to his, is anybody, his crazy. Has, now. has anybody oh, yeah, seen the, uh, the new Nirvana documentary on HBO? Not yet. Yeah, it's, it it's unbelievable. It I, wa dope? I watched it twice in one Oh, good, good, good. And uh, about, uh, uh, no, no big spoiler here, but I'll just tell you. About, uh, about 15 minutes in, you find out that there's a part of Kurt Cobain's life when He's in about, uh, he's, I think he's like a freshman in high school or sophomore in high school, and he's just obsessed with having sex with somebody. He'll, he's just obsessed with it. And what happens is, is he ends up uh, hooking up with a, a, a mentally retarded girl. He lost nice. his virginity to a mentally retarded girl. And, uh, <laughs> and everybody at the school picked <laughs> on him, and he was very, very uh, antisocial, but uh, he, had a, he had a chance. And that's what you remind me of, Josh Fry, is that part the of Kurt Cobain girl? that fucked the retarded girl. Like <laughs> the retarded girl, right? Ninth grade. I remind you of the retarded girl? No, no. Right. Retarded girl fucker. It's right. much worse. Yeah. <laughs> that's worse. Well, as David Tell would say, those titties ain't retarded. That's true. <laughs> 
So, Josh, are you re- are, are you really homeless? That's really happening. How long have you been in L.A.? I'm homeless by choice. I've been home. I've been homeless 12 days, and I've been in L.A. 12 days. Oh, by oh. choice. That's such a white dude move. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna be homeless for a while and get back to it. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking <grid>, awesome, bro. <laughs> Yeah, uh, that that's a that's a fucking privilege, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Are you really a cashier? Oh, I I, uh, I left <laughs> left my job on good terms. I was a great cashier. Where at? Uh, this food co-op. It's a great store. It's not like it looks like any normal store. With every department, but it's a food co-op. And I was a member. Are you gonna get a job here in L.A.? Hell yeah, man! I went somewhere today. <laughs> Hell, I went Hell somewhere yeah, today, yeah, and I dude. said, "Am I gonna get a job? Fuck yeah, I'm gonna get a job." I said, nobody's snagged me up yet, man. So that's I what I told man. the dude. He what laughed. I, what I like is all of his stories are the same style as his jokes. It just makes you wonder what the fuck is going on. Mm-hmm. I like that. Now when he, you, he headbergs his way through life. Yeah, yeah he's, he's Mitch. He's Mitch soon to be dead bird. Whoa, oh, God oh, damn. Oh, 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 where's oh, the mandolin on that? There you oh, go. There it is. Oh. No, not just musical comedy. He's also a pun oh. master. Yeah. That yeah. dude doesn't fuck around his, over uh, there. He's got his sidekick fresh off a of Book of Mormon tour. Uh, <laughs> playing the mandolin. Right <laughs> now, Josh, let me ask you a question. Uh, when you go, when you go to the barber, do you ask for the sad magician, or do they just <laughs> <laughs> like? Do they? Is that your thing? Is that what you ask for? Did that grow into that? Do you have to be homeless for 12 days to be able to shape it that way? <laughs> Christian Leitner rocked a similar haircut in like 96. You might be the only homeless guy that uses a blow dryer uh, for his daily <laughs> hair tube. Oh, man. I took a shower at LA Fitness today. Yes, yeah, son. Um, I had the same lady, my friend's mom, cut my hair. I never let anyone else touch my hair but my friend's mom. I got a haircut before I came out you here. You do have the body of a guy that would go into an L.A. fitness just to shower, by the way. You are very skinny. <laughs> I was thinking about taking a yoga class. Nice. Uh-huh. You look like a creepy yoga yep. teacher. You could do that shit. Yeah. <laughs> Downward facing dog, bitches. <laughs> <laughs> Namaste, hoes. <laughs> So what do you keep in the case on your pouch? That'll be my final question. wallet. Yeah. Oh, that's the wallet? There's a lot in there, man. Just when you mu- sleep in money behind the bus station, you've got to keep that wallet on the belt. I think it's a smart move. It's pretty nice to not, because I'm always checking phone, keys, but I know the wallet's there. Mm. Fuck yeah. Like a mini, mini fanny pack. Hey, man, I really appreciate this, and there's a lot of comics who want to get up here tonight. Look at this guy. Oh, you're just, I love you're, Josh Spratt. Oh that he's that selfish either. I he's going to be all right, dude. I love it. Don't we'll sleep on Josh Fry. 12 bitches. days in. Sure, I'll fist Josh Fry. Ah, I love there he goes. Dude, Josh awesome. Fry, everybody. Yeah. Magical. Yeah. I love Josh it. Josh motherfucking really Fry. My God. He all he needs is his stage time, and that shit's going to work. That's true. Jeffrey Dahmer is wondering what happened to his mustache, and we found it. It is unbelievable. <laughs> Flavor oh. saver. He really is well uh Ooh. Oh, he just hit his head on the light back there, if you're wondering what that thought oh, was. Oh, that's awesome. That was the best that part of his See, Every part of him is just horrific. You know what? <laughs> this guy made his debut on the show. I remember him from last week. Last week, we saw him for the first time. Oh, yeah? and, uh, oh, wow. And this oh. is his uh, second time on the show. Uh, put your hands together for Tommy Godlove, everybody. Man, Tommy. that's a good... Godlove! Damn. Tommy Godlove. And that's... Tommy Godlove. Yo! Being polite, letting what people the... go up the stairway. That. All right. The Hell show yeah. will wait. Here we go. How you guys all doing? All right, <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna call again. Okay, my name is Tommy Godlove. I'm half uh, Mexican, half German, which basically makes me a uh, Mexican 2.0, as in uh, a Mexican 2.0. Oh, you don't speak any Spanish? Yeah, I don't speak any Spanish. But uh, before you judge me, I do. I am uh, bilingual. I speak uh, American Sign Language with an accent. Um, what was I gonna say? Uh, I hate when people try to tell me about my weight. They try to give me uh, advice and stuff. Uh, I had a friend that tell me, uh, you know what? The key is that you need to uh, stretch and do resistance in the morning. I said, that's bullshit, man. I do that every morning when I put on my shirt and all that stuff. <laughs> I do all that shit, so you need to shut the hell up, man. I don't care if you're a kinesiology major. That's all I got. <laughs> all right. Fuck yeah. Hey, hey, hey. That's it? He knew the kinesiology. So how, I, I, wait, wait, wait. No, wait, 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 wait. You're obviously I'm out of breath. Know. I'm out of breath. You're, no, no, you're, 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 people like you. 
You're a likable dude. I am. I mean, good smile and shit. Good skin, exfoliation. I could tell. Good, good last name. Good, he fuck threw in the God shit. love. I'm God, God free. free. God love. Hey, Damn, I got to show you some love. Yo, tour. What, what would you do with the sign language with an accent? Fucking demonstrate it, dude. Well, how would you do it? Uh, See? Figure it out, dog. <laughs> Damn. No, on some real shit. Like, no, it, because no, be you're like sign language better. with an accent. We're like, oh, fuck. How would it look? Yeah. That's what people were waiting on. Yeah. yeah fuck true. that up. I did. I did. I did. I did. You want to see what is a what does an accent look like? This is you know, did some shit. This is a stupid joke. This is No, no, fuck time. that. Yeah. Every joke I is I wanted stupid. to know it's stupid. All your shit's dumb. But you, <laughs> but, but you add some uh, shit to it. No, I'm fucking with it. But he's like it's a dumb joke. No, it doesn't have to be. Add some shit to it. Act yeah. it the fuck out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boom, dog. Godfrey. <laughs> you pulled a... Is Godfrey the only one who actually might make these guys better? Usually yeah. we just... <laughs> we usually just say mean stuff. You want them to suck and keep picking out of the hat? <laughs> yeah, that's what the Shame on you. Are. I want to see some improvement in some of this shit. <laughs> I, I like the irony of your name being Godlove and you wearing a 666 t-shirt. Well, that's I got, nice. Hey, I got to represent. It's Del Rey. Um, <laughs> I, I like, are those jorts or are those basketball shorts? I don't know. They're golf cores. Golf shoes. Golf shorts, shorts, fuck yeah. Golf nah, shorts. you can't really fuck with this dude. He'll fucking punch you out. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I mean, look at this guy. Nah, he, yeah. That's God that. I got knocked out by God love. D yeah, that's the dude you want on your side. Dude. Godfrey's gay that. for God love. <laughs> Godfrey's gay for him. You hear? Do you hear? No, it's whoa, not gay. Whoa, 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 whoa. You hear? You hear? No, it's you, not like, gay. You were, but you were like, you were like, that, that man, rolled up sleeves of yours man, is gay. Shut up. You got, man. Rolled up sleeves with no muscles. You got nice. Mouth. You got nice lips. <laughs> you got, but you kept saying no, 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 and talk, shit. Talk, talk. You said you were like word. you kept saying you kept saying like you were like you're like oh god oh oh god hey Mr. God love you got nice lips and shit. No one said you that. Got exfoliate. Said, well, you look no, like that's you what got you're a, saying. Oh, like, you got a nice smile and no shit. No one said that. You got a nice smile and shit. <laughs> He's ready you to play. You got nice lips. You're fucking up and he can't play because you're fucking bombing. Hit me. See he can't even play because you're bombed, dummy. <laughs> Those are my favorite insults. Wrong with a Gordon Heat erratic. Dummy. When did you Ramble. become a Dell Razor? A long time ago. Uh, so do you, is he one of the guys that you kind of look at his comedy and you're trying to be like a Dean Del Rey? <laughs> what? Is have he you, like have an you ever influence? Heard that is he an influence? I support, I support comedy. Yeah. That's what I can do. When you go shirt. to the barber and you ask how they are going to cut your facial hair precisely, do you ask for the sad magician? Or nice, do you nice. Do call that. Sad it's sad magician he facial hair. If magician. you're wondering what facial hair goes with his haircut, yeah. it's that facial hair. <laughs> he's got his mustache. They flipped it earlier. This, this guy, oh, that's every no hip hop Fry. DJ that. face. That's hip hop station DJ face. It's yeah, Rick Ross. Yeah, Rick Ross, all kind of dudes. Cholo, Chirna you're a mixture of all those dudes, man. That go to a lot of authority in there. Oh, says, yeah. do you want the hot or he the mild to salt? To his jokes, dude. <laughs> you just add, he's got to add to your shit. Tommy, what do you do for work? I work at 76. Oh, right. shit. I just right. had about yeah, you. Yeah, you want some? No, nah, fuck, fuck that. Guys. That one off of Wilshire? No, nah, Riverside. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah we'll, we'll drive out there to get <laughs> You'll gas. You'll drive out there? <laughs> <laughs> What's the gas price right now? Uh... 386? No, fuck that. Oh, I have, a oh. Qu I have a question. I have a question. Why is it when you prepay, that last dollar goes really, really slow? Like, is there any reason for that? Because that seems like that technology is really outdated, and it should really... Because yeah. if I could just turn it off... Is yeah. it a Commodore 64? Is it, or is it because that most people will just drive and be like, I am t no time for this, and it like adds up, like saving that dollar, you know... Unpumped if gas. I knew that answer, I wouldn't be working as a clerk yeah. making minimum wage. You know what I'm saying? Damn, wow. son. Yeah. Yeah. See, see how he gets tough real quick. I, yo, if I knew that answer, I wouldn't <laughs> know just, it. Just, fuck you know, I, don't, I don't know dude about the dollar. Not, I don't know about the dollar, though. I dude, hate like, that fuck shit. comedy, yo. But, but when it's cold and all that, it messes with the, the tanks and all that, and it Tommy, goes slow. When's the last time you punched somebody in the face? Yeah. Oh, see, he Never. did it. Come was on. It was the last time God love. I can't do that. Come on. I can? Oh, yeah. You just call yourself God love. From now on, you're like, let give it up for God love. G love. Boom. G love. That's it. Boom, son. I liked your set this time. I liked it last time. I think you just really need to slow down and be more. Yeah, uh, I was. Just I, was it. I just went too fast. Be more yourself. This yeah. is your second time up. Yeah, I went last last week. Th your second time, period. No, like six times. Six. Th oh, that, well, that's like said, no. No, like no, 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 no. You got it. <laughs> you got a while where you'll be shitting your pants for yeah. a while. Yeah. So I get it. Yeah, I get it. I Shit. like you're like this. You're sick time. You're like no, no. six times. Six time. No, he's like no, six times, dude. Time. Yeah, that's why he's still <laughs> shitty. <laughs> yeah.
three no, times. But you just got to add to it, though. I think you should, uh, this is what I personally think, that you should like, kind of stay in the joke. Don't just fucking skip. Kids, stay there and go, yeah, you know, sign language. and blah, blah, blah. Okay, let me demonstrate that. You know, especially kind of have some patience. You only a have a bit. minute, so there, you should really only be one telling joke. one joke. Fuck it. Yeah. Yeah. Unless you do one-liners, in which case you should stop doing comedy. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imitate people? What's up? Can you imitate people at all? Can you change your voice? No. Nah. Okay, fuck it. I, mean, no, I was going to say use that too, but fuck it. <laughs> Can you? <laughs> fuck yeah. Who can you do? Uh, who you want me to do? I don't know. Bill Cosby? That was bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> what were you doing? You're sitting in your power of sign language. You want to see it. That's good. That's good. good. It's good to have Cosby on the show like for that. the first like time. Keep awesome. my hand that's on my That's before the rape. That's before rape. Before? Yeah. Cosby before rape. Wait, hold on. Do you Wait, do you have a? Do we have, have a, you expanded to a Cosby during rape? Yeah, I have. <laughs> I have. Oh, okay. Do <laughs> Damn, that was good. <laughs> Here comes the pudding. Oh. Oh. I don't know why anyone groaned. That was I had to go cool. there. I knew they it would. I just, it was an easy one. Oh, man. Tommy, Close them down. Tommy, uh, when's the last time that uh, you raped someone? Never. <laughs> Never? Never. With a name like God Love, you can't do rape. Uh, I, I know what you're going to say. Get, not with that name. Not with that name. <laughs> not with that name. <laughs> You'd get away easy. Oh. Yeah. Fuck yeah, Tommy. Well, keep doing spots. Well, keep I'm rocking fine. and rolling. Well, you certainly you. Yeah. do exfoliate. Your skin really is glowing. You like, you like it's that? very it's clear. Glowing. What do you what do you, hey. you do right? What do you do for that? I don't you have know. a lotion? I, don't I don't say know. you don't know. It's a. It's not. I, I use lotions. I can admit I use special lotions. I get paid to put lotion on Chatterbait. It's a it's webcam. It's, it's, it's all webcam. It's a Mexican glow. Mexican it's a Mexican glow. Mexican glow. There you there you go, it everybody. Is, he, blue. He, Puts orange peels on his face before bed. Uh, you know, Mexican German glow. and Mexican. German and Mexican. But Mexican just beat the shit out of Germany. <laughs> <laughs> it did. Und what are you doing? Get out Dominated. of here, fucker. Get out of here, <laughs> orderly, fucker. <laughs> We're going to look Mexican. Fuck your jeans, fucker. <laughs> Dominated. Und what are you doing? What are you doing? Yeah. yeah you're Mac. That's it. Now that's fuck it. that German shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a soccer game. Fucking Mexico wins. I you, do. Have, you have kids? Yeah, I got one kid. Amy. You only have one kid. One See, kid. there's something German about him. Only one See? kid. You have one Remember kid? An His name's Angel Godlow. Angel! Fucking, that's Mexican. That's Angel. Mexican. No, Angel. That's some real shit. That's so Latin, Angel. Especially when his middle name is Jesus. He's, Angel. Fuck, that's great. That, Angel, Angel Jesus Godlow. Nice. How old no is Angel? No Moses in there? <laughs> He's gonna be How old is Angel Godlow? He's going to be 14. Damn! Wow. How many boxing championships does he have already? Uh, <laughs> Angel Godlove? I mean, he's I mean, got to be a champion. He is, he is. Amateur. Yeah. He's an amateur. He's an amateur. 800 and zero, that record on that guy. <laughs> All right, there he goes, everybody. Tommy right, Godlove. Nice, right, Tommy. Tommy. Good job. As, as Jeff Fry would say, other comics want to go. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yeah. Oh, man. Oh, so fun. These are some of the best comics I've seen so far, Tony. So far, so good. But uh, this looks like a new name. Anything can happen. Put your hands together for Judd Zumwalt. Judd Zumwalt. Zumwalt. Wow. Zumwalt. All right. Fuck yeah. So I just got back to L.A. this week, right? <laughs> got in on uh, last Monday, Tuesday, got punched in the penis. Let me back up a little bit, all right? I was at the DMV. Who's supposed to be watching Mexican kids, man? Somebody supposed to be keeping an eye on them? They are all just, one just ran up to me. Yeah, thank you, her. I, uh, no, another one walked up to me, stared me in the eye, and coughed a breath mint into my hand. That's all, all right. I, uh, I just had my birthday, and uh, it occurred to me that uh, we shouldn't be blowing out birthday candles, man. That's still food. People are going to eat that. <laughs> like there was entrees too. Like I didn't walk up to him like, "Hey man, uh, you got a steak? Hang on, it's my birthday." Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I made a wish on your steak, so now it's coming true. Josh, I like that you don't have a house, but you have a gym membership, dude. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Priorities, man. I guess. All right, that's uh. There you go. Fuck yeah. Yo, some what? <laughs> Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. Yo, you you look like the dude that plays Thor, son. Thank you. 
Good looking dude. Fuck the bullshit. You know your hair. You got the hair shit. <laughs> and that shit was funny. The Burt Godfrey. It, it, it was funny. You're obsessed. It's fucking funny. You're a funny dude. Thank you're obsessed you. with you people. Me smile. Funny? Thank you. And their you're hair funny. and their Let skin. Let me see what you think. Oh, that was shit. funny. <laughs> that was funny. And his Thank smile was like, yeah. Oh, that was funny. <laughs> and Lord knows He's you funny. love a good smile. Thank you. You're, 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 you're bombing. That's, that's on the attack. Quit drinking like you have confidence, fucker. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker sucking on a drink like he killed. I feel like... <laughs> I feel like you're getting payback for what Ian Edwards said to him. He was like, I'm going to take the entire race on for this. Oh, that's all right. But I thought this shit was funny. That Thank was the blowing on good food bit. joke's that a really great. good bit, man. Thank you, great. Thank you. Uh, what was the first thing that you talked about? The Mexican kid Mexican, punched yeah, you, and then no, what happened? Said, the fuck was that? <laughs> Getting punched in the penis. Ugh. <laughs> and get then, rid of that shit. Yeah, right. and then what happened? I don't know. Yeah, I yeah, lost I get you completely. That. Yeah, I'm uh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> he apologized. Hey, I'll just bail <laughs> yeah. I like that. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, I, no, I, no. It's just, it was a bunch of kids running willy nilly, and one of them just happened to. Willy nilly? Where were you, you from? Where are you, from? Are you from the 50s? <laughs> <laughs> hey, so these kids are willy nilly, all right? <laughs> Missed that. Would you like a newspaper? Kind of like the 50s. <laughs> yeah, she. <laughs> Go see a movie in and then the fuzz, And then the fuzz came. <laughs> Titanic. <laughs> hurry, hurry, get your paper. People are running willy nilly. No, I'm from uh, I'm from North Carolina, so it's kind of like the 50s. You're How, fucking those... Thor. You're the next Thor, dog. Right. Are, those, are those sweatpants? <laughs> yeah. What? Are those sweatpants? They're uh, I don't know. I think they're called joggers. They're pretty comfortable. Fuck yeah. I know they all look right. ridiculous, but you can wear whatever comfort. the fuck you yeah, want. Yeah, so. you, <laughs> you can get mad ass. I, know I that. feel like out of everyone that performed tonight, you're the one that's going to look the most like you were in Collective Soul, which is... <laughs> <laughs> is it a compliment? We'll find out. Uh, you got Collective Soul and then Kurt Cobain's uh, retarded... Thor's <laughs> little brother. I don't know. <laughs> See, I was thinking Lemonheads. The lead singer of the Lemonheads, sure. maybe? Yeah. That works all too. great compliments. There's <laughs> a lot of it's all getting him ass. No matter. Yeah, you have a lot of charisma, Judd. Thank yeah, he you. does. How he many does. girls did you stop fucking to come down here and do it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for real, dude. Like how many at once? I mean, you, you have come on your shirt right there. Yeah, I can see it. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> those are little little those explosions. Are, those are, oh, there's more over there. there. Wow, that's, oh, that's everywhere. Two, that's two different loads. Nice. Clearly, that's what's up. clearly two separate loads. Multiple that's not even that. one wild shot. <laughs> <laughs> this is a guy who fucks all day. I mean, yeah, you, your yeah. your hair is yeah. Girls like it's that. It's crazy. It's crazy, though. Yeah. I mean, I mean, if Chris D'Elia saw that hair, he would kill himself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, no. <laughs> My hair's way better. <laughs> I just got a text from Josh. He wants to know if you're single. Interesting. <laughs> uh, yeah, but... He's, wow. Of course he's he really is. He's type. always single. He, <laughs> just, he just broke three girlfriends' hearts in the back of the room. Like, what is single? Right. What kind of last name is Zumwalt? I, it's German, I guess. I, I yes. don't speak German. but uh, Eat your heart out, God love. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Ah is good. What's Judd? That's North Carolina, huh? Yeah, that's, that's exactly where it comes. That Just is, name yeah. him Judd. <laughs> he's the, but on Twitter he's the Judd Zumwalt, the yeah, one wow. and only. Yeah. Wow. Not Was there be... already a Judd Zumwalt? <laughs> there, no, it's a, I used to be a little bit douchier. And I thought the Judd was cool, and it's just oh, okay. the stupidest <laughs> thing I've ever done. And I, I, and I dropped it, but now it's just stuck on my Twitter. Were you a jock that. growing up, a bully? No, I was actually a nerd. But nerd. Uh, and then I kind of grew up, and then you showed the world. And then I got kind of douchey for a while. <laughs> I know you, you got, got the world it. back. <laughs> Your hair is huge. Thank you. It's not a game, dude. It's not a game. <laughs> Fuck is Josh Mark? Yeah, is he anywhere he's back there. I told in the world? You. Anywhere in the universe? What are you even doing right now, Josh? Watching the show. Why don't you watch the back door? <laughs> Do you want to see if our friends here can you need a seat anywhere, Josh? Parents are good for Josh Martin, everybody. Yeah, really, he's the best. Really impressive. He's really on the A game. There's an empty table for two right here. Right here in yeah, the front. Right here in the front, Josh. You're all over it, buddy. Is that Dennis Hoff? Yeah. Hey, Dennis. How you doing? Hey, Ron. Ron Jeremy. Ron Jeremy and Dennis Huff. The one oh, the Jeremy's only. in the Owner house. Owner of the famous yeah. Bunny Ranch. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Josh got that hint and is grabbing you guys the table. Either that or he's really a whole nother level of bad that I can't even fathom right now. Bunny Ranch, man. <laughs> he always comes to the Comedy Cellar in New York City. Yes. He's hanging a out with Rich fan. Boss in the... 
<laughs> yeah. Oh, what's up, player? Ron, Ron, we know you're here because obviously we just found Judd, who is your arch nemesis, because he's the only guy that fucks more than you. Uh, <laughs> look at this fucking guy. Yeah. But it's possible. <laughs> what's that? Small boys. Oh. Fuck yeah. Ron's on the. Ron's a roaster, guys. Yep. Yeah, Ron's like uh, my loop from that movie Looper. I gotta kill him because that's what I'm gonna be in 30 years. <laughs> nice! Hey. Oh shit! You the boy's it. funny. I'm telling you. That's great. Joe Joe got Ron's funny. Come on, Judd. Shirt, you, <laughs> Judd, Judd, you better be nice. Ron can stab you in the throat with his dick from right from here. There, yeah. <laughs> from the room. But the problem is when he gets stabbed with that dick, it literally puts a sewer like size hole in the in his chest. So <laughs> fuck Christ. Christ. Oh, nice. Nice. Must be a stretch. You, uh, yeah. you, want me to, you want me to get off of here so you guys can bring somebody else up? Oh, yeah. Oh, I did not get an He asked really ask a question. Thing, guys. Hey, it's like he Jeff Fry question. says. You know, other comics want to get up, Judd. Yeah. That's what I said. You want me to get out of here so other guys oh. can get up? Uh, did your hair sign up separately on its own piece of yeah, paper it's tonight? Up next. <laughs> how, long have you, how long have you had hair like that? Uh, three years. Three years. Yeah. And w what, what you, you must have just been a whole different person three years ago. Yeah, huh? yeah. It just, I've had it short my whole life, and I just thought. And then uh, you just went. Yeah. <laughs> You got out of North Carolina got and you said, it's now, 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 now. <laughs> What happened first, the hair or the move? I'm going to grow my hair. The hair. Is down. Yeah. The hair. Yeah. Now, 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 now. you realized you had hair like that? I'm going to grow my hair. Now, 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 now. And I don't care. Now, 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 now. You to be a nerd. <laughs> I love it that even when the mandolin comes through, Godfrey <laughs> still sings the backup uh, instrumental. <laughs> <for that song. laughs> He's like, that's not how it's supposed to sound. <laughs> 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 this guy has a homosexual guitar over there of some sort. <laughs> <laughs> guitar had low self-esteem. Yeah. It's like a man on mandolin. <laughs> hey! Nice one. Nice one. He worked it in. Did you hear that uh, joke I made that, that got blocked by that music? <laughs> you said yeah. some kind of homosexual guitar, That's and right. I said, yeah, it's a man on mandolin. Nice. So oh. that actually is a mandolin. That's a one in a million wow. joke. Oh, nice. Yikes. Is that a pun? Because we could have given that to the guitar comic. No, if it really counts as a pun. Is that me? Is it was, that the, it am was, I the guitar was, comic, it, it Rick was, Ingram? It was, it was, yes, you are. All right. I meant, I meant to know your I'm name. I'm a musician. Pat's trying to slam dunk it He's tonight, everybody. He's really... <laughs> <laughs> How many scotches does that guy have? He's just sucking on ice right now. He's getting wild over there. <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh, oh, well, thank man. you for having me. Zumwalt, <laughs> great shit. He's like, why am I'm I gonna still take up this here? This now. <laughs> We're insulting others. All right, right on, man. Right on, right on. Right on. Judd's going going in for the fist bump. I've seen him around. Give for Judd. Yeah. Around, so. <laughs> He's been patrolling the puss on the front patio for weeks. <laughs> Unbelievable. I love what's happening. Who is the next week? Ron, you want to come up, work out a minute, or what? Okay. <laughs> Wait, all right, whatever you He's want. Chilling. You just let me know. Ooh, this should be interesting. This oh, is a dude. new name. Uh -oh. oh, my God. Uh -oh. A L B. Al B. Uh oh. Holy shit. Oh, oh yeah. I was raised by a Mexican grandma, and when I was little, she'd tell me things like, mijo, if your hand ditches, you're going to get money. When I got older, I realized it was scabies. <laughs> and as a child, I had pinata parties. Pinata parties are cool as, an, as a child, but as an adult, they're kind of creepy. What sort of message are you giving a child when you give a child pinata? Saying, hey, mijo, who do you love? You love SpongeBob. He's your best friend ever. But you know what you love more than SpongeBob? Candy. So what I need you to do, get that stick, kick their ass, and get some candy. 20 years later, same person. Hey, mijo, who do you love? Your wife, your kids, your job? You know what you love more than that? Methamphetamines. <laughs> so what I need you to do, get that stick, kick their ass, and get some candy. For meth heads, 20 is a new 50. Ice-T's real name is Earl Grey. Thank you. Wow. Yo, man. I like that energy. <laughs> Fuck yeah. the bullshit. I liked his energy. I, right? He brought, he, he, I like that he fucked his first joke stunk, and he still took the mic. Like, I got some more shit for you, baby. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> no, I like that. I like the fucking pinata shit. Fuck that yeah. was funny. No, I did uh, Lowered yeah. his voice and shit like that. How long have you been doing it? 13 years. Fucker. <laughs> oh, my God. That was whack. <laughs> um. <laughs> 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 
Hey. Well, See? 13 years with that bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> that was unbelievable. That's always one of the fucking greatest things. I thought it was like his third time. His 13 no, years. I'm like, no, no. That was whack. No. He went. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's one of the greatest moments went, ever. I, I, I'm supposed to do this to you. I like that he went with the, the creepy character. Oh, it was just creepy. like he's like, he is the kid fucker. Right. All and of a sudden, yeah, well, out. In a minute, it's a little tough to make yourself yeah. likable before you like get into the. Mm -hmm. I want to fuck kids. <laughs> Creepy candy voice. Yeah. Wow, well, oh, I, I really like your style, you know. Obviously, you're going for the, uh, you know. <laughs> you're one of the few people, one of the few comedians that actually has the balls to dress like a corpse. And uh, I like that because this way when you die, like, they don't have to really do anything to you. They just... Yeah, I thought it was more inside. like professor from Saved by the Bell, the college years kind of thing. But or, uh, what but is I'm it? What kind of magician? <laughs> Sad, Sad magician. magician. <laughs> that is true. You're wearing the clothes that match God Loves Beard that goes with Josh's haircut. I would say more substitute teacher. Ah, oh, fuck you. We ain't opening our books. Yeah, right. <laughs> we, ain't, we ain't doing shit today. You've had the tie a while, either that or Judd Zumwalt came all over it uh, earlier. Oh, so, Did we already cybers? forget the Judd? Judd from Judd seven minutes ago? Judd comes everywhere, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Have the decency to remember that. Al B, 13 years. So where yeah. are you from? Houston, Texas. Houston! Laugh stop? Laugh stop, dude. No longer exists. Houston yeah. Improv. Houston, Houston, Houston Improv. Stop, um, Houston Improv. Open mic, yeah. How long have you been in L.A.? Uh, it's my first month. Wow. Oh, wow. First month. Welcome to L.A. Where, right? where did you spend the last 13 years? I had a one-bedroom apartment for $550 a month. And hmm. you're down in Houston? Houston, yeah, okay. next to all the clubs. So, nice. and, and why didn't you perform at them while you were there? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I mean, thirteen. Far how far between? Thirteen far years. Between. How often were you going up? I went years. up every day. Pretty no, much. you did. Yes, I did, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like that. Fuck like, you, yes, Godfrey. I did, motherfucker. <laughs> Fuck you. Uh, would you like to do the? Uh, would you like to do the Death Squad show Friday? Yes, sir. All right, sweet. Let's try. Wow, look at that. All right. Wow. Yeah, That's Al? who gets it this week. Oh, Al, yeah. Al. Al, yeah. You're not done yet, Al. I, Anyone from I have Houston. to make fun of you more. Go it's stand behind the microphone. Go for it. Go for it. We're going to yeah, see 13 years oh. at 13 work years. on the Death Squad show. What? See, you, squad. you have a girl? Or, mm, broke up years ago. Years ago. So yeah. a, a simple no would have done that. <laughs> yeah, you're giving very specific answers. Like you told us. Yeah, 550. Like, what do you think we are? Like, a, we're deciding your credit line or something? No. <laughs> we are I've West Side the, Rentals. I've yeah. watched Figured the show out. for about a couple of months. So, about a month as long as I've been here. So. Is that jacket edible? That yes. looks like it's Hershey's, <laughs> like some type Fruit of roll chocolate. Up. That's like vintage smooth shit right there. Yeah, have you ever always worn the jacket, or is that something you just do for comedy, or is you your it's jacket every day guy? Or? Uh, jacket every day guy. The chops, you got the pork chops, the seventies fucking sideburns, yeah. shit, the Abe Lincoln joints. <laughs> what nationality are you? Mexican, Mexican. and Iranian. Mexican Damn. and Iranian. Wow. Mexican beat the shit out of Iran. <laughs> <laughs> Mexico Strong always man. wins. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Even when you take off your glove. Nope. Mexico yeah. wins. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Mexican and Iranian. That's yeah. crazy. I'm from Kansas, so that's just Mexican as far as we're concerned. Yeah. <laughs> that's in that et cetera category that we don't know about. <laughs> Mexican Iranian. So what do you do? Blow up your own fruit stand? Nice. <laughs> nice, dude. <laughs> I mean, oh, blow up your own just Delicious fruit citrus stand. everywhere. Oh, oh well, um, he's getting sh he's getting shows out of it. So yeah. Albi is it. working, man. Albi is working. Be sure. Yeah. And that's l short for your last name, Bamani. Yes. Why do you go by Albi? Because they can't pronounce Bamani in Texas. <laughs> <laughs> they pronounce they it Bahamani, Bahamani. What Bohani. the hell is that? Be yeah. Bo it gets <laughs> and you're Bo you're from you were born and raised in Texas. Houston, Texas. Yes. Right wow. On. Houston it's all a good the way. City, mm -hmm. man. How old are I you? I love Houston. Thirty-five. 35, and you just moved to L.A.? Yes. Uh, sure. What's your apartment like here? I mean, at 550, 7... Uh, I have a glorified closet, which I share with five other comics. Damn! Wow. Yeah. Is, do you guys have room, by chance, for Josh Fry? Because <laughs> we mu Anybody he, has room. Look how skinny he is. If you make the first month's rent, sure. We're waiting for our, our other roommate to room out. Move out, and then we're gonna have another room. For there you room. go. How, how do you Josh. stack? How do you stack up like that? Is it bunk beds? What, what's the? I have a glorified closet, pretty much. So wow. what's, what's your layout like? Twister. 
I have one guy has the <laughs> one guy has a room up front. Another guy has the living room. Another guy has a small room. Another guy has a room, and I got the closet. Fuck! Wow. How big's the closet? It's about the size of the stage. Wow. That's, good. That's not bad. That's, that's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm New Yorker, so I'm like, yeah, that's yeah, not bad. That's, that's, that's good. good. That's, that's a condo, goddammit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Split this up and get a roommate. Fuck. Pretty, very nice. <laughs> <laughs> On sunset. Do you, do you have a job? <laughs> yeah. What do you do? Deliver food to rich people. Oh, oh you're going to be all right. Yeah. Yeah. You're Postmate? Right. What that's kind of rich people? That's awesome. To yeah. rich people, like how, who? Like, I've delivered to... Some like penthouse apartments and shit. On like, like Hills. is it Postmates? Like, anybody? No, you keep... uh, DoorDash. DoorDash. Door. Oh, Door. Door Dash. That was like Door Dash. Dash. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking like windbreakers from the early nineties. The guy Bell Bell Dash. <laughs> Door Dash. Okay. Yeah. It's, right. Same you, thing. All right, all right, fuck you, it. Were you ever married or anything in Texas? I had a girlfriend for five years. Fuck um, yeah. Stepkids. Damn. She. She had. They were your stepkids. No, they were her. They were her kids, not mine. Right. Texas chicks are crazy. Uh, how many uh, fights did you like? Physical fights did you get? I have a gunshot wound and I have in my lip, and I have TMJ for being punched in the head by another cop. Wow, yeah. Brian punched you nailed in the head it by yeah. one of your roommates, shit. right? Texas yeah. bitches be sleeping. Crazy. He probably kicked you in the face. It happens. <laughs> That's a t- Where did you get punched? shot? No, he got punched in the um, face. Oh, that was I was delivering sandwiches to my roommate, and a guy tries to mug me. I jump him, knock the gun out of his hand. He shoots me in the foot. Damn. We still catch him. So, yeah. Damn, you did karate shit? No, I just jumped. You just knocked the fucking <laughs> gun out of his hand? Yeah. He had held it sideways, so I jumped, knocked the gun out of his hand. Damn! We both went for the gun at the same time. He was black, right? Because yeah. he had it sideways? Yeah, sideways. That's how, that's sideways. how I knew by race, by the way he held it. I didn't have to even say <laughs> He's like, he had it sideways. You were looking at me. Yeah. <laughs> or That's a bullshit. I shoot like this. Bang, 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 bang. <laughs> he was like this. Yeah, he had it sideways, Godfrey. Yeah. So I was able to fucking. Yeah. But he put, the, he put the gun right over here and pulled the trigger point blank at my foot. He just shot your foot? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Damn, yeah. That's, a, that's a very kind thief. Yeah. 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 He really... I'm going to shoot your foot, motherfucker. <laughs> you ain't going to walk right, right in, for today. Right in your metatarsal, dog. <laughs> Very familiar with the human anatomy. Oh, Robert. very much so. <laughs> Shot him in the tarsals, baby. You know how we do. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Al, have you tried to date anyone uh, while here in Cali yet? Anything going for you? you take nothing. anybody back to the closet? Uh, nothing. <laughs> nothing. A fella. Maybe a fella. That would be the best nothing. option. <laughs> You, you it, got, you got, yeah, that'll be good. That'll be interesting date, man. You come back to the uh, house. You know what? Well, though? this is where we're going to be fucking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if she sticks around in that closet, though, you got a good girl. There. That's a good yeah, girl. Loyal. Maybe, maybe she'll think you're adventurous. Like, maybe she'll just, just think it, you know, next day, like, oh, man, I met this new guy. He fucked me in the closet. It was crazy. <laughs> You're going to be, like, be having a new R. Kelly new, video. God damn. She has no idea that that's just your bedroom. <laughs> All right, Al B. Congratulations, awesome. you're at the end right of the show. Right on, Al! Yeah! Al- 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 Big Al B! He's on Twitter at Al Bahamani, B A H M A N I. Bahamani. If you're, in, if you're in Texas, it's at Al Bahamana. Al Bahamana. Oh, we know this guy. Uh, put your hands together for Billy Bonnell, everyone. Billy Bonnell. Yeah, yeah Billy! <laughs> Yeah, thanks. I don't know how to start this. Stereotypically speaking, they say really hot girls are dumb and ditzy, and uglier girls are really smart because they got to try harder. It's not my personal opinion. It's just a stereotype. But I did see a scenario one time where it played out perfectly to it. I was driving down a busy street at the beach, and two girls got out of their car to cross in front of me where there wasn't a crosswalk. One was attractive, one wasn't. The ugly girl paused on the curb to let me drive by, which is smart and safe. But the hot chick ran right out in front of my car, which is dumb and dangerous. And I had a slam on my brakes, and I was like, what the fuck? How did that ugly bitch know I would run her over? (laughs) Thank you. Fuck yeah. Got it in. Working it out. That was funny. Billy. (laughs) Period. Yeah. How's it going? How long have you been doing it, dude? Six years. Okay. Almost seven. 
All right. Yeah, I yeah. like that pause and shit. He tricked us, that fucking, you know what I mean? Misdirection. Sweet. Dude. That was good. He knew what he was doing. He knew what he's he was fucking confidence. doing. Look at him. John Belushi face. <laughs> 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 yeah, we know we know Billy well. Billy, uh, you're here all the time at the comedy store. You do so you know you I also don't have a house. <laughs> really? <laughs> no idea. <laughs> hey, look at everything. Is he everything us again. Everything's true, man. <laughs> yeah. Hey, but I, that guy, the last guy, lived in a closet. Yeah, I live in a closet. You do? Yeah. How big's your closet? It's pretty small. It's like a walk-in closet. Fits a queen bed. Like Damn. From wall to wall. Wow. Big. Yeah. Something. So then every time yeah, you have to use the bathroom, you have to come out of the closet. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, you know what's fucking crazy? The bathroom's basically in there. I don't even have to leave the closet Is, door. Are you sure you're not just shitting in a bucket, Billy? <laughs> it's in the corner of your closet. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's a bucket. The way you said basically uh, there's shit. a toilet in there yeah. wasn't really convincing. <laughs> like, uh, I mean, it's a, it, it's a small hole in the ground. There, right. It's a bathroom. Basically. I mean, it's a puppy pad, but basically it's a bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yeah, Billy. I like your style. Excellent. How long uh, have you been? Have you been able to bring any chicks back to the closet? One, yeah, one time, and that really made me like lose respect for her. Really? <laughs> Rightly so. Wow. <laughs> what a what a pig, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Why, man? She was like nice, but she had sex with me in a closet. And I'm like, you need to get your life together. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Maybe she was homeless. Does this count as a second minute? This guy's killing. He's crushing He's right killing. now. He's killing. He's smashing off of us. Look at him. He just looks out there in the cosmos and crushes. He does. Boom. He just stares right Confidence, out there. Confidence, man. I still live in a closet, though, so who's winning? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> but I, should I have taken I like a step to like the underlying twist? anger. Fucking great. So you really lost respect for her, huh? Did you ever, uh, did you ever have her back? Did she came back a couple times. <laughs> <laughs> I, and he, that's he when I started losing respect. <laughs> <for stuff laughs> right. No, I lost respect for her initially. She came back a couple of times. I started to lose respect for myself. There you go. Yeah. Because I'm like, you kept inviting her back. Right. Because good closet. I need ass. To, it's the only way I can feel stuff. <laughs> it's to fuck a chick in a closet. <laughs> right. <laughs> that's gonna be my fetish one day when I get married. I'm like, I need to fuck you. Yeah, it's like we have a, a walk-in closet. You're like, do you talk about matter. this at all on stage? This no, just that, that was just now. Struggling, sleeping I, in a closet thing, and then you lose respect for the girl. No, I try to pretend that I'm doing really good at stand-up, man. <laughs> trying to pretend. <laughs> 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 that's a testament to Hollywood. You can get on TV and still slip in a closet. Oh yeah, no, oh, that's true. Yeah, that is true. So keep plugging away, guys. <laughs> <laughs> He's just so. If you, hey, if you leave me up here long enough, I'll start getting real sad. So let's wrap it up. <laughs> wow! Look at nice. that. Nice. Nice. I love that. You're honest. <laughs> yeah. Look, look. He's so much more confident, and it just <laughs> seems like he knows his voice better. I think than a yeah, lot of these man. other guys. Mm. Yeah. yeah, definitely. We need to give him at least two minutes in the future. I think. Yeah, yeah. definitely. And when I say we, I mean you, because it's yeah. your podcast. <laughs> yeah, yes, definitely. Yes, Next yes. time you get two minutes, Billy. But but yeah. we were gonna split them up in between episodes. You get one minute one day and then one minute oh day. yeah look at yeah, that you, guy you get two minutes i would still enjoy it. is the next spot guaranteed no billy why, uh, weren't uh, you a guest on this show yeah in san diego <laughs> <yeah>. La Jolla. <laughs> i love stage time what do you want me to do not put my name in the bucket oh no i love it uh, uh we've been on the road a lot billy at crushes uh, yeah he's one of the one of my favorite comics to watch and uh uh, nice you movie. really, me and Billy need to go. Uh, we are planning a Texas tour in the future, so hopefully we get to go out there together. Uh, Fuck yeah, dude. Do you have anything Fuck coming up that you want to promote? Yeah, do you have anything you want to promote, Billy? Uh, not really. Oh, yeah, June 13th, uh, I do a comedy show in Mar Vista in a backyard. It's pretty fun. <laughs> nice. It's, real. it's a nice. good show. Comedy good at the show. Manor, June 13th. You've been. Yeehaw. Hey, Pat Reagan destroyed that show. No, he didn't. And now, <laughs> hey, <laughs> he did. God, God the best. <laughs> hey, we. You know, <laughs> I have a I have a life outside of being a punching bag on this show. I would like to say. Pat Reagan did Whoa, our first. Ra <laughs> <laughs> Pat Reagan. Young Glenn Campbell. <laughs> Pat did our first show as the musical guest, and he murdered. And we're like, the next show we got to have another musical guy. We picked a different guy who also did good, but we were still sad that Pat wasn't there. All right, Billy, you're right. You are getting sad. Right. Um, <laughs> there he goes, everybody. <laughs> Billy Bonnell. Yeah. Crushing. I like He's it. He's up there, Billy Bonnell. <laughs> 
He had a he had a professional comedy voice. I appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, right? yeah. he yeah. knew he's like uh, got a minute, one joke. A lot yeah. of poise, a lot of poise. It's fun. Yeah, you know, that's a, that's an example of like sometimes uh, sometimes See, really good comedians sign up. I need some shitty game. ones. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Come on, I need somebody to just start it today. Put your hands together for David Neeker. Oh hell yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's out. Yeah. That's out. New. It's your ass over here. It's like here. a German N word. I know. <laughs> yeah, it's sure. It's a German N word. All right. Hey, I just quit smoking weed. <laughs> I'm celebrating four and a half. I quit January first. I'm celebrating four and a half months of abject depression. I smoked a lot of weed. I don't look like the zigzag guy for nothing. Is this how people feel? <laughs> people say you have a lot of dreams when you quit smoking weed that you dream again. It's totally true. I dream. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Telekinesis. <laughs> that never happened when oh, you were stoned. Shit. Never. <laughs> One of that should move, baby. For you audio listeners, a lantern just fell in the front row of the audience. One of the Chinese light lanterns. Let's reset the clock. Thirty seconds. Go. Yeah. Wait, what? No, don't don't restart. Just oh yeah, just just, go, just keep go. going, Dave. People say you have a lot of dreams. You have dreams again when you stop smoking weed. It's totally true. Every night, I dream about scoring some weed. That's all I got. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Restarted. Well, I've never. I, I can never say out of all the sets that I've watched on this show that I've never seen a lantern uh, falling completely change the course of somebody's set. But it's almost like it's almost like we forgot that you bombed for the first forty seconds that you were up there. The, the, the lantern it probably had the best set of the night. Yeah. <laughs> the lantern came in, crushed, and oh. got out. It's I think just, he brings wisdom to this comedy field. I like his. This is the older look, that wisdom. Look at that. It's That's true. Mount Sinai fucking beard yeah, right there, it's huh? True. I love it. The comedian. Yeah, yeah man. It's, it's like the kind of wizard. Soft spoken. It's the kind of wizard that presence. would rape you. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. That's what it is. Trucker. Trucker. No, he has yeah. not even trucker, Philosopher. but he has that big presence but soft voice. Likeable. Yeah. I like that yeah. shit. Thank you. Yeah. You're very welcome. Keep smoking that weed, dog. <laughs> I'll probably go back soon. I know you're going back. <laughs> I can see it in your eyes. <laughs> have, you, have you felt better since you quit? Like, I mean, I felt you... bad for a while, but I'm starting to feel better now. I did a lot. I slept uh, like a lot. At first. You have to. What about yeah. memory, because I feel like that's the one thing that I've noticed the most. It's just memory, short-term memory loss. You, you know, from no, smoking true. weed. Uh, my memory's okay. My concentration isn't as good. Oh, it focuses uh, you, right? It, it, it helps me, you yeah. focus. I quit smoking like a year and a half ago, and generally what I found is that I, I still have nothing to do all the time. <laughs> but I'm aware of it always. Yeah, that's totally <laughs> happening to me. Totally, it's not that cool, actually. But <laughs> what uh, what daily habits have changed from the lack of pot smoking in your life? Well, I don't smoke weed all day. <laughs> that's uh, the main one. Right, that would be one. Yeah. yeah. I said. I, I'm pretty sure I just said that one. <laughs> you look like you would grow some of the shit at least and I sell tried, it. I've tried. There you go. Not selling it. But Fuck. Grown it. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. I've I've been uh, like I said, I slept a lot more uh, for a while, but uh, trying to exercise a little, and uh, I haven't been able to write as many jokes actually. Really? Yeah, I can't concentrate. <laughs> you said, you said, I, I've, uh, I've got some jokes. You said, that's all I got, dude. <laughs> that's what you said at the end. Well, yeah. I, that's all I got about reading. I haven't been able to write. That's all I got. Did you write that at the end of the fucking show? <laughs> well, I've got other jokes. I'm sure you, man, I know you do. Dave, how, how long have you been doing stand-up? Five and a half years. This, Damn. Uh, this exercising that you're talking about doing, how far have you gotten? What are we talking about here? What have you done? I walk a couple miles every day. That's it? Yeah. No push-ups or anything? Uh, not yet. Not yet. How, where are you walking? I'm hitting a speed bag, too. i got a speed bag. See those mitts? Look at that fucking fist. Holy Jesus shit. Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck. Fuck. It was like, I hit the speed bag every once in a while. <laughs> you do? You hit the speed bag? He, he hits it once, and that's it. <laughs> <laughs> he walks away. I'm done. <laughs> And then you walk for two miles. Yeah. I, used walk, I used to walk five miles every day, but I broke my leg. And so now I'm getting back to it. Now, like, what happens when you hit two miles? You just lay down? 
<laughs> like, Wherever I go, back, I go back to sleep. People are like, <laughs> they see the beer, they're like, he lives here, let him be. That beard, that, is, that has got to be one of the thickest beards I've ever yeah. seen in my entire yeah. life. I mean, it looks like you have angel hair pasta connected to your face, like somebody just glued it but to it's you. Good. It's a good one, though. It yeah. is. It's Fucking very dope. powerful. Hell yeah. It's yeah. a wallet size photo of my back. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> What? Everyone's like, what? <laughs> what? I have no I'm, idea what I'm that hairy. means. He's, He's hairy. hairy. Oh, hairy. you're hairy. Yeah. Oh, I got gotcha. you. Have you thought about shaving it since you're, you know, this is like you're, you're exercising no, now? That's like my look now. Like, without it, I don't, I look like Elena Kagan. And, uh, a what? A what? She's a Supreme Court justice. She's not Jeez. an attractive Wow. Oh, yeah. yeah. You, you got that's a stand. reference. <laughs> you don't know Supreme Court justices. <laughs> Right. What a bunch of fucking so losers in this I look, audience. I look exactly I'm like I'm, I'm, guessing, I'm guessing Supreme Court justices is something you started learning in the last few days Supreme since quitting Supreme Court justice. <laughs> you watch CNN like, I'm going to use that no, girl's no, name. Really <laughs> She's a congressman in the 48th district. You guys don't know that? <laughs> Morons. I was very functional with pot. I went, you know, went to work every day and all that stuff. Where'd you work? Uh, I'm an advertising copywriter, but now I'm s sort of getting out of that and performing more. I got an agent. I'm going out on auditions. She is. And, uh, He's gonna be in some so shit. The, the pot is, you but, know, yeah. it's not good for the yeah, acting right. and the, the being on stage. It's not. So I wanted to sort of get out of it a little. I'm telling you, you're gonna and, see uh, a gang of shit. Wow. Yeah, I've been. I've had three callbacks and I put on a bill for. That means you ain't in shit yet, in man. The last two weeks. Though. <laughs> you can totally. <laughs> not yet. You three callbacks be like, come back here. Nah, come back well, here. But nah, it's getting closer. Yeah. No, I can. Uh, you're gonna be in something. Watch. Are, they, are you know. they sending you out on anything that isn't like, uh, you know? No, rapist? it's all no. It's all like tow truck driver, biker, lumberjack, rapist. No rapist. <laughs> yet? Have you you Please tell me you talk about. He that lost upstairs. the part to Brad Watson. I'm starting to. <laughs> I, I smell Law and Order. Mm -mm. Fuck yeah. I see this like, yo, I, man, I, you I look like a rapist. A film where I, <laughs> I can tell by your beard. I can tell. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I Thanks. just did a film where I played a Saudi Arabian prince who gets killed while he's in bed with a hooker. Fucking oh, nice. Wow. It was a nude scene. Nice. Damn. No, that, that was real life. They weren't filming that. It was, uh... <laughs> did they have a close-up on your back? Yeah. Really? You'll see, yeah, you'll see Thick. the back hair. No, we won't. We will never watch this movie, uh, so we won't see the back hair. Never in a million years. Turbaned up the back just to keep the hair covered. I figured somebody should see me like that. Smart. Should see you nude. Yeah. They really got you nude in a movie. Yeah. And what did you have to do in this? Chicks on top of me. She's a hooker. We're having sex, and then an assassin comes in the room and kills us both. And then they spend the rest of the movie trying to figure out who killed me. Nice. That's what they told you the rest of the movie was going to be about in yeah. the in the in the soft core porn that you shot for forty dollars. <laughs> yes. And they didn't tell you that that's the whole fucking scene. They told you that there there's a whole bunch of other stuff that you don't need to be part of. Yes. The Mystery of Northridge. Check it out on Cinemax. The Mystery of Northridge. <laughs> Your Cinemax. first opportunity. <laughs> Can I just say, when I first when I first moved here, I went to a taping of the Green Room with Paul Provenza, and afterward I took a leak next to Ron Jeremy. Is that right? Yeah, and right. everybody asked me the same question. <sighs> Did you look? That is a trick question. First of all, you don't look. Second of all, I've seen it before. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. 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 There you go. Oh, That's whoa. great. David Neeker. No, he he saw he's, that. He's he kind of he kind of saw. He that. was in the doorway. He snuck his head in. I can still see his dick his hanging in the middle of the door. <laughs> his presence is here. His, his presence is here. He's sitting back there going, "I looked over at Neeker's and that thing, <laughs> right. unbelievable." That's yeah. why they put me in a movie. Right? The Persian penis. Fuck yeah. <laughs> the Silver Surfer. Whoa. Because of that great fucking beard. Look at that thing. It's amazing. Thank you. It's unbelievable. It's amazing. You're totally going to be the bad guy in the new True Detective. I hope I'm really so. excited I'm for it. I'm telling you, he's going to fuck around and be in I had an audition Watch. for, uh, it was an ABC Disney series regular. <laughs> what Makes the sense. fuck were you? What? Uh, yeah. I, I was a cook, a camp cook from Maine. A camp cook? <laughs> <laughs> what was your line? Can you give us a line from it? That fish ain't going to gut itself. Damn. <laughs> what? Nailed it. Wait a second. Nailed it. <laughs> ABC <laughs> Family? <laughs> That fish ain't gonna I'm sure gut it. Get it. I'm sure I didn't get it, but so it was supposed to be a creepy chef, right? It's like a kids show, so yeah. <laughs> Obviously, I love it. Nice. There he Fuck goes, yeah. everybody. David Neeker. Yeah, David. Yeah. He's on Twitter at David Neeker.
Whoa. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. Come wow. on, Neeker. He's a big man. Neeker dropping the mic. Fuck dropping yeah. The mic. He's Treating like, I'm out. Microphone like a like a Def bag. Jam comic. Hell yeah. <laughs> Toss it down. <laughs> I'm out. So Bam. Boom him off the stage. <laughs> David Neeker. Rub the stump. Give it up for my man, David Neeker. Dropping the mic. <laughs> Funny thing is, he's been on the show a few times. When he smoked pot, he never... Tripped over the microphone. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. A few days without marijuana just goes to show, throws off everything. <laughs> Guys, this is the part of the show where we have two regulars that do a brand new minute every single week. And they've been doing this uh, since the beginning of the show, since it started a long, long time ago. Boom. It's 924. Nah, I'm not, uh, yeah, no, we can't. Because we always end up going too short, and then if if we have time, then we'll do another one after. But anyway, uh, put your hands together. We can't do another minute. First comedian. (laughs) First comedian that does a new minute every week. Put your hands together for, you know, from Dysentery, you know, from Kill Tony. It's the one and only Sarah Wineshank, ladies and gentlemen. Here she is. What's up? Yeah. That's fun. (laughs) Guys, I was looking for a thesaurus last week. I asked my friend, hey, you got a thesaurus? She was like, what the fuck are you talking about? Nobody uses a thesaurus anymore. Like, if you Google the word thesaurus, it just says, did you mean 1982? (laughs) What's going on? And also, like, okay, in in terms of the thesaurus, like, if you don't know what the fuck a thesaurus is, then you sure as hell don't know what a synonym and an adjective are. Because you're depending on a thesaurus. I was thinking about it, and I was like, I wonder if the word thesaurus is even in the thesaurus. <laughs> like what would that say? <laughs> All right. There it is, a new wine shank man. Right. I like um, that she stayed committed to the sword. Yeah. That's it was it. almost a it was almost a tongue twister. The sword. It is a tongue twister. <laughs> I thought it was a, a a gay dinosaur. I was gonna say something about <laughs> reptiles. Reptile. The yeah. Thor. <laughs> you know what the thesaurus. Thesaurus. No, Roger. It's always Roger's. What's that? Roger is the brand of thesaurus. Oh, it is. Oh, oh Roger, yes. Look that up, yes. Roger. It's Roger. R O G E T. I'm not lying. The Roger's thesaurus. Oh, I, yeah, I can picture it now. Blue G-E-T. with a red line under or something like Roger's that. Roger's thesaurus. Look is it, it up. Is it French? I think so. Because <laughs> I would just say. Don't Roger. say Rogettes. Yeah. Fuck that. <laughs> Roger's Roger. thesaurus. There's only one way to find out whether that word's French or not, and it's by looking it up in a thesaurus. Boom. No, a dictionary, dictionary motherfucker. That's you right. dumb motherfucker. I'm a, I'm a big dumb idiot. Uh, uh, I like that she went, uh, she's doing a thesaurus joke, and it, it didn't work. And then <laughs> she was like, oh, yeah? We'll enjoy 30 more seconds yeah. of thesaurus <laughs> jokes. Because that's what you get. What did you say antonym? I thought you were going to say antonym. You said adjective. I meant antonym. God damn it! Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Because you said antonym. adjective. I said okay. adjective? Yeah. yeah, you said adjective. I was what like, oh, fuck? I think it's antonym. Yeah, no, that's wrong. Because that's, that's, that's a wordy fucking joke. So, you know, you gotta, of course, you got to work it out. Of course, you only had fucking 60 seconds well, and shit. Right. But thesaurus, you got to, you know, thesaurus, that's a thinking fucking uh, joke. You know what I mean? Yeah, I've been yeah. thinking about it. I've been thinking about it all week, and I don't think have, harder. Yet, I've it. been thinking super hard, and this is what I have. And I was like, I don't know. Yeah, I'm Roger, Roger. Roger. Remember Roger. Roger? Add that in there. Roger, Roger. Fucking add that Webster in there. Webster and Roger. Or yeah, maybe okay. if you go with. Uh, yeah, that's right. Add, you, add that in is there. Is thesaurus in the thesaurus? And then you go. I bet if you look it up, yeah. it says a book you used in 1988 or whatever. Yeah, it was. That's yeah, 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 yeah. And I just, I just looked at uh, the thesaurus.com. Yeah. Thesaurus is on thesaurus.com. What does it say? It's just uh, reference to glossary. Like glossary. I it's, knew it was going to fucking say glossary. It's a blue and a black dress. Reference book. Is there any Rogers? <laughs> you can just love this Rogers. Oh, it's all Rogers. How much are they paying it's you? It's not the candies, this? Rogers. I'm talking about yeah, 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 yeah. Have you ever seen Godfrey? He's great. Loves the Rogers. <laughs> That's the right. Soros. I like to bring that up. <laughs> Excuse me, do you have the Rogers? He has an exclusive It might be a fucking wine, dude. <laughs> 
the real situation is really that the, we don't have books anymore, right? It's these fucking phones that everything's on. Well, the Kindle, man. Kindle on your phone. I got Kindle on my phone. Yeah. Kindle on your phone. You got Kindle on your phone. Yeah, I read a book o off my phone, half of it. Half of it? On a Kindle. All right. It's kind of hard, though. You don't have the pages. Actually, yeah, it's like fuck a it. fucking it's freaky. Do they have Cliff Notes on Kindles? Yes. Spartans you can get all that. You can still all cheat. All that shit. All that shit. Beautiful. You can still cheat. <laughs> <laughs> still cheat. Yeah, that's the, most of the books I read were four pages long. Yeah. Thesaurus. Remember when this was called Hinchcliffe's Notes? Yeah. Those were right. the days. One Thor. How long did that last? I think one, one, week? Or one week, yeah. The Thor. Wow. We changed it quick. It's too long and it had an apostrophe in it, so it wasn't good for hashtags. Anyway. Uh, so what's, a synonym for the, <laughs> what's a synonym for Thesaurus? Huh? Glossary. Glossary. Mm -hmm. what made, what, Glossary. Glossary's like a mini dictionary. What made uh, mm -hmm. what made uh, thesaurus so passionately a part of your uh, vision? Because Just out of curiosity, did something happen? Did uh, it's an arbitrary thing, and I I really wanted to dig into it, and I know that it needs work. Um, but I think that I'm on to something here. <laughs> yeah, don't don't Sarah. let the audience. Steer yeah. you away yeah. from <laughs> from the gold that is the thesaurus. Absolutely, Sarah. Sarah, I think you should look in a thesaurus for different stand-up topics. Damn. Ugh. Ugh. Wait, 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 wait. What's oh, synonym geez. for ugh? All I heard was a sad mandolin play. I didn't get to catch it. <laughs> What'd you say, Pat? I said I think she should look in a thesaurus for different stand-up topics. Wow. Yeah. Wow, you went for that, huh? I mean. You were <laughs> <laughs> Jamaica Bumba Clot <laughs> Not a mercy. Okay. Just insulting over there. I think if the you look, Pat, what's happening over there? If you look up what? Never Seen a Vagina in the Thesaurus, it says Pat and Guitar Comic. <laughs> <laughs> if you look up wait, what did you say? <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, he wanted to hear that. He, he, wants, you, he wants you to repeat I just, it. I didn't want to bring the fire. <laughs> he said, What did you say? What did you, oh I didn't hear what you said. Oh if you look up Well, when you watch this episode, Pat, you're, you're gonna, gonna have a good it. laugh. No. Uh, <laughs> you'll hear it next week, motherfucker. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Wine shank, what else? Everything else good? Everything else is good. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Yeah. At the bow tie. Rocking the oh, right. uh, bow tie that nice. says the Captain's Jack. Female sad magician. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> On a ship. Yep. Uh, on a cruise ship. On a cruise ship. The love boat. Absolutely. I love it. Well, you did it again. Another brand new minute from Sarah Weinshank, everybody. All right. Another brand new minute every single week Weinshank. from Sarah Weinshank. She's on Twitter at Princess Shank. This is an incredible last names on the show today. Always, wow, always. Shank. Next Impressive. one, next one's a cool last name too. Uh, she's from the great state of Florida. After her very first time <laughs> doing stand-up comedy great here state. on Kill Tony, Florida. started here two years ago, and here she is right now, ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Kimberly Congdon with another new minute. Condon. Damn. Thank you. I think I'm bad at. Uh, Forcing guys to be my boyfriend. Uh, I'm not really good at it because, uh, like, in the one instance that I do like someone, uh, I accidentally suck his dick too soon. <laughs> you ever do that? I don't know why I do it. Um, <laughs> I went for it. Uh, Jesus. Mom's not going to like that. Uh, my dad walked out on us when we were younger. Uh, it's sad. I think it's more awkward than it is sad. Uh, Cause he kept coming back to be fed. <laughs> it's like just go, dude. <laughs> just leave. Uh, so I have abandonment issues, uh, and I decided to go online and uh, seek therapy for it. But the web page was unavailable. <laughs> that was a stab at the heart. And then my computer packed itself up and got a new family. Okay. Nice. That's exactly a minute. Oh yeah! She timed it out. She yeah. timed it perfectly. She, she knows what she's doing. She does the internal clock? What the Kimberly fuck you Condon. doing? Very powerful. You know what the fuck you're doing? Another new minute. Man, that sucking dick thing really took some pride out of me. Well, but <laughs> we were all like, "Word, yeah." <laughs> but <laughs> what you got to realize is you can you can <laughs> never <laughs> suck a dick too fast <laughs> because there is some truth to art, you know. I just I. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to, I was trying to kind of talk about when you want to date a guy and you want to hold out. The, oh, the worst plan ever. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're familiar with that. 
<laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's not really how it works. If they, if they don't, what, what it, guy oh, here yeah, has been like? Nah, she that. seems cool, but she sucked my dick. So, <laughs> yeah. just, fuck that. I don't yeah. think she's right for me. Yeah, you can't just. That's true. Can't just yeah. be sucking dick haphazardly. You know what I mean? You gotta <laughs> haphazardly sucking. <laughs> that's one of my favorite movies. That haphazardly. <laughs> Was possibly filmed by by Zeger or whatever his name was. David Neeker. <laughs> David Neeker, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to his creepy laugh in the back of the room. He's back there too. <laughs> what is that? He's got the laugh of somebody with his look. Look at the outline of him right now. I love now. that outline. Yeah. Scariest thing I've ever fucking. If you seen. saw that in the corner of your room at night, <laughs> you'd be like, man, I need to smoke pot so I don't have this dream again. <laughs> it's horrifying. <laughs> All right, second dick. Now we move on to. I like the abandonment issue. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, that's that's like the that thing we like funny. after getting our dick sucked. Is those are the two big things guys I like are looking a, for. I like abandonment. Yeah, I leave. She's not even going to get that mad when I leave. She's used to it. That's going to be. How great is that? Yeah. And then you come right back to get fed in the closet. <laughs> <laughs> And what came you have after good abandonment? Jokes. You have good jokes, man. Huh? What was after you have abandonment? Good jokes. What was the last thing? Um, um, just my computer leaving and getting a new family. Yeah, yeah should, th- that, that part probably could be rewritten, right? Like the dick suck thing. Out. Yeah, and the dick suck thing, I think you should break down like sort of what we just talked about with it, too. You know what I mean? Like the fact that some girls think that holding out with some, you know, yeah. I mean, it's not really... Uh, yeah, that's not really a thing. Yeah. I mean, maybe like back suck in the it day. Someday. Yeah, well, I'm yeah, feeling definitely. much better now. Yeah. <laughs> we know. Well, what we're out's saying not is we support anymore. you. Well, it must be a catch-22. Like, yeah, we support you, but at the same time, if you're really looking for someone to fall in love with you and they're not falling in love with you, it, it be, and you're sucking their dick soon, <laughs> then you. It's like, what's wrong? Yeah, there's something else <laughs> that you haven't figured out yet because that's it's not the true. fact that you're giving oh, blowjobs too don't soon. Don't you turn this around on me? <laughs> <laughs> she seemed perfect, but. But if it's good blowjobs, <laughs> girls blow take jobs. pride in good blowjobs. <laughs> Girls take pride when they're really good at it, though. No fucking, they're, no, they do when they're good at it. I feel like all it. girls say they're good at it, though. No, 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 no. <laughs> well, most of them. <laughs> God, no, 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 no. I'm not very good at this. They're not it all doesn't good matter. At it, but Just I feel go like for they it. They all say they are. I feel like. I feel gum it, gum it. I am terrible like, at blowing No jobs. teeth, no cool. teeth. Get the go teeth out of there. Yo, Muppet <laughs> suck me. Muppet suck me. I think. I think, like, all girls saying they suck dick is like, equivalent to guys telling girls uh, that they can't come from head. It's like all guys say that. Just really? To get you to never said it, right? that. I've yeah. never said that. <laughs> Damn, you've like, been tricked so many like, times yeah. before. I haven't been tricked. I said it's a challenge. <laughs> you like need it's to, a lie. You, you, I know I mean, it's not true. I mean, you could do it, but I've never come before. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> You're really good at this. You that's fooled me. <laughs> Who are you fucking, Tim? That's what I'm saying. Guys <laughs> say that to get you to be like, oh, I can do this. And it's like, right. obviously they can come. They're trying it. to get a little effort. Yeah. What's going on. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> like, make it like a challenge. Guys say those things. I don't want you to feel special, but I always come during blowjobs. <laughs> <laughs> keep it up. A little role reversal, I think, would be in order. Yeah, that's that's an interesting one. I've never, I've, n- I never even thought that that was something that guys did. Yeah, I've heard it. That's a thing. I've, like, I've oh, heard I'm, it from a somebody... few people and girls have agreed that they've been told that too. Wow, wow, yeah. wow. never heard that in my life. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's man. An interesting and I one. suck a lot. I came would, on I the gate. You came on the gate with the dick sucker. That's what I thought Tony was gonna say. He's like, I've never heard someone say they can't come from a blowjob. Like, Whoa. <laughs> well, Tony, what situation were you in? I mean, I would just imagine that that would almost. I, I would picture that it would backfire. Like it would be like, oh, that's, that's, that's a great way to not yeah. get your dick sucked. Is oh, I never come from getting my dick sucked. Yeah, like, oh, never mind. All right. Yeah. Who would? Yeah. No, no. It seems like a rough Pepsi challenge. Totally. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fuck yeah. Get what else, Kate? Uh, you know. <laughs> are you really? What else can I say? After are you really that? trying to date somebody? Are you really trying to find love yeah, right now? Yeah, no. Yeah. No. You're lying. <laughs> You're lying. Just performing. Yeah. Cause she's she's she, she's attractive. You comedy attractive. I can yeah I can have. <laughs> no, I'm fucking with you. Whoa. Oh shut Damn. up. Shut the fuck up. Damn. You don't know. Wow. I'm saying cause all you do, all she God, does is God, hang God, around God. comedians. <laughs> all she's around is comedians. <laughs> it's the truth. And she's the comics come at you, don't they? They're like, hey, what's up, right? Yeah. Because there's sure. a lot of there's a lot of comedy, comedy girls in there, attractive. 
It's like watching a basketball game, a girls basketball game. You're like, eh, there's a couple of them. <laughs> you know how every once in a while you Hold go, on. damn, that girl is, that girl, the point guard is hot. Fuck. I don't, has anyone ever thought that? <laughs> yeah, there are a couple. There are a couple. All right. Women's softball. Yeah. Huh. There's some hotties in women's softball. Wow. Oh, really Jesus. trying to pull yourself out Damn. of that one. <laughs> That's the sound of uh, Sarah Weinshank shooting herself they for shoot. not being called comedy attractive when she was up here. They shooting. I made you look. You the slave in the Fuck. page in my rhyme book. It's a rough night. We just lost Weinshank, everybody. Uh, <laughs> hey, uh, Cam, I bet you can't no, make me calm. She's, she's currently in the trunk of Meeker's car. <laughs> she's attractive. Period. You can't make me calm. Strangely enough, the only other thing in Meeker's oh, trunk right now. He said what? you can't do it. You can't make me calm. Yeah, that was my joke that I don't fall for that. You can't do that. Oh. Okay, bye. Brian's beating Damn, a dead horse. Bye. Bye. To close out strong. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like every time I've done the show, Brian gets really creepy with me. Okay, oh, really? Is that yeah. That's, that's, been, been thing? that's been two oh, okay. years of. She knows she's attractive. Uh, she has choices. Okay, bye. She, she boom. The boom. powerful brand new minute from both of them. There she Good is job. again. Kimberly yeah. Congdon, everybody. <laughs> yeah. We did it again. That's an episode of Kill Tony right there. Pat Reagan is that Patty Reagan. Kimberly yeah. Congdon, Princess Shank, Don't call it a Josh back. Martin. I've been here for uh, years. Godfrey, what do you got coming up that you want to promote? Um, my show on Fox my May 27th. It's called Bullseye. It's on Fox. It's me, Kellen Lutz from Twilight. We co-host. It's a challenge stunt show. May 27th after Master Chef. Fucking awesome. Fuck so yeah, yeah Bullseye. check it out. Bullseye. Everybody, Bullseye. On Fox. Everybody knows it's on Fox. Yes. It's clearly sponsored by uh, Roger Thesauruses. Roger, <laughs> not Roger. <laughs> Roger. How dare you? Uh, the There's great, no R at the end. There's a T. Fucker. The great and powerful Rick Ingram, ladies and gentlemen, since episode one. That makes me sound like a sad magician. <laughs> <laughs> the quadruple great callback. Powerful. <laughs> Follow him at Rick Ingram at Godfrey Comedian on Twitter. Godfrey Comedian, uh, yes sir. Uh, so much fun to this our is friends awesome. live stream, you stream. We all stream. You <laughs> <for laughs> <Uustream>. stream. <laughs> Kill Tony. Oh, nice. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Good night, everybody. Everybody, get your dicks up.